<laughs> Let's talk about this film. I mean, how excited, exciting was it for you guys all to get back together? And how excited are you for people to see the film? Mm. Um, after today and our marathon today, I know I'm supposed to speak as, as a, this fresh day, but it, I mean, just the experiences that we've had um, thus far, my excitement is, is mounting. I've had the opportunity to speak with the, a few different people that have seen the film um, in this setting and situation. And they've made me even more excited to see um, a general um, reaction from audiences. What about you, Morris? Um, I, I'm, I, I was excited to get back together. Um, all, of, of, all of us coming together was just like riding a bike mm -hmm. with the chemistry and the camaraderie. Mm -hmm. That was great. Um, I have a great anticipation. I'm a little anxious. Um, I really want people to really come out and enjoy the film so they can support it, and hopefully we can make more films of this, this nature in, you know, in the future. So I'm excited, just anxious right now. You know, Malcolm says he wanted to tell a sophisticated story. Mm. Um, can you talk a little bit about the storyline this time around and how, you know, it's holiday setting, things have changed, or have they? Um, the, the story is more sophisticated than, than the first because we've had these, we had these great relationships in the original film and then now there's 14 years has passed and so you really have to really understand what has transpired in those 14 years you know have you had certain conversations have you discussed certain things and have you you know swept things under the rug and where are we now with our feelings and our emotions and our thoughts about things that have happened in the past all of that while dealing with a huge huge issue in this movie um, so everything is a lot more layered than the first one I can't think of two more people, any other people than you two in the film that really go through a lot. Right. Mm -hmm. Can you talk about just, I mean, this is a meaty role for, for both of you. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. Can you talk a little bit about handling that meaty role and the challenges of hmm. it. Wow. Um, it was definitely a challenge. Um, and uh, somebody asked earlier about my expectations of, of Mia's growth um, from the first film to, to this film and, and whether I had had expectations of who she had become and where she was to. And I explained that I had zero expectations, um, but as an actress, I welcomed the challenge to go through what her journey is, um, to see that if I could m meet the art imitating life or life, bringing life and breathing life into that um, situation or circumstance, and since my life is completely different in terms of, like, Mia's characteristics, I embody that. I have some of that. But in terms of the se successful family life, four children, I don't have four children. Mm. <laughs> mm. Um, successful husband, I don't have it. <laughs> so being able to um, be that and in, in, in embrace that and bring that to life and be a part of that and then um, enjoy the... Um, beginning, middle, and end aspect of their relationship. And then also um, enjoy the aspect of friends reuniting and coming over to the house and kids playing together mm. and trying to stop fights. <laughs> <laughs> you guys and like And stop mess. <laughs> <laughs> you had fun though in it. Yeah, no, it was definitely fun getting together and shooting everything together. And, and no, I wasn't. Well, no, it was it was challenging. It was challenging, but it was but a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. The dinner scenes were fun. Yeah. The dance scenes were fun. Dance scenes were fun. You know, the football. So we had fun moments, but it was really hard. I'm um, really just focusing on our characters and what we had to do. It was really hard to just to really just relax certain times because you know we had these daunting scenes and they weren't just done all on the same day. You know, we would have to do one scene and then maybe a couple weeks later do another heavy scene. and then So it was never really a point to where I, um, I never felt that whew, that's out of the way now. Let me go have some fun. It was like, whew, that's out of the way now. When is the next one coming up? <laughs> then after that, when is the next one coming up? You know, it was always that. Kind of like life, a roller coaster. Ex yeah, exactly. But people, you, want, you know people are going to enjoy this film. They've been anxiously awaiting, yeah. you know. How do you guys feel about fans being so excited about this film? 
I don't want to let them down. I just, you know, I just, I'm just anxious because I, I hope that they can appreciate it, and I and I hope that they feel it's it's equal to or better than the first. So I, don't, I just don't want to let them down. You're not. 